All right, now go to your Epic Games launcher and then click on settings and then scroll down until you see Fortnite. Over here, you click on additional command line arguments. It will give you a box like this. And then in the description, you go over there and you copy something that looks like this. Okay. And just come over here, control C and then control V to paste it. And that's basically it for Epic Games Launcher. All right. Not many know about this, but it, there's something called timer resolution. Okay. I'll link it in the description. Basically, when you download it, it's like 500 kilobytes. You click on default and then you go on maximum. OK, so basically what this does is just it will re uh, like reduce input lag when you play games, uh, when you're editing, when you're like doing anything. I would just suggest you guys leaving this open and just minimize it into the background. Cleaning your temporary files. To do this, click on Windows key plus R. It will give you a box like this. Type in percentage, temp, percentage, then click enter. It will give you this uh, location. Uh, over here, you just select everything and then just delete. Click on delete and everything will be recycled. Uh, as you can see, some of them are being used. You just click on this box and then click on skip. Uh, for this one, you just click on continue and you're done. Half of it is already gone. Now you're gonna do that again, Windows key plus R, but this time remove the percentages. Maybe if there's some left, you know, there you go. There's a lot of left. So just control A, then hit the delete key and then click on continue. So as you can see, there's some being used and then just click on the box and then click on skip. There you go. Just keep doing that. And your temporary files are now deleted. You can go on recycle bin and just delete everything. All right. Now we're going to go to NVIDIA control panel. Right click on desktop NVIDIA control panel. Uh, these settings are just for NVIDIA users. If you use AMD, I suggest you Googling or something. So go over to program settings and then choose Fortnite. Just click on the arrow and then just choose Fortnite. Uh, so I don't want to waste your time. So I'm going to leave screenshots in the description below so you can uh, copy them and just Put it as it is, okay? After everything is done, go down here and click on apply to apply all the changes. All right, if you're using Chrome, uh, I highly recommend you to turn off your hardware acceleration. That is in case you use Chrome when playing the game, like to listen music and stuff. I'll just suggest you turn off the hardware acceleration. You just click on the slider and you just have to restart and it will be good to go. But I'm using Brave, it's different than Chrome but you can easily find it you can, or you can just google it because i don't have chrome installed don't judge all right so the same applies to discord okay many people use discord if you don't have discord when you're a gamer then i'm sorry um go on the settings of discord click on appearance and then scroll down and here you go hardware acceleration it will be turned on but you just have to turn it off because it's just it will save you a lot of FPS, okay? All right, now I'm gonna talk a little bit about um, physical stuff. If you have like a computer or a laptop or PC, you can always upgrade your parts. So if you have 8 GB RAM, I don't recommend you using 8 GB RAM because it's just not worth it. Upgrade your RAM to 16 GB and you will see a lot of difference in the gameplay, okay? So that's a little tip for you to invest on. All right, in the game, go to settings and then go to audio tab and then scroll down a bit. As you can see over here, sound quality. On default, it is set to high, but as you can see right here, they say but that it might decrease performance. So make sure your sound quality is on low. All right, now again, go to settings. And on the first tab here, as you can see, uh, these are my settings. Make sure you always use performance mode because it it is a built-in uh, rendering mode that allows you to have lower latency and higher FPS. So make sure you always use performance mode. If you think that other rendering mode will give you better FPS, then you're just wrong. So make sure you put VSync off and just 
put performance mode, restart your game and you're good to go. Make, make sure everything is on low and always, always play on full screen mode, okay? It's like the main thing. Also, if you want, you can reduce the 3D resolution a bit, but for me, it works like around 90 or 100.